Hey friends, today I am at the Magic Kingdom because I have kidney stones. Let's go do this. The reason I say I'm here because I have kidney stones is because it is a scientifically proven fact that riding Big Thunder Mountain can help you pass small kidney stones. They actually did test about it. Like they actually came to Disney and actually rode Big Thunder Mountain with kind of like a fake kidney that had stones lodged inside of it. And they found out that because of all the turns and the twist, it actually helps loosen those stones so that they're easier to pass. And even the doctor in the ER I went to go see suggested it and said that it's a very fun way to actually pass a kidney stone. So we're gonna ride Big Thunder Mountain and we're gonna see what happens. Maybe it'll help me, I don't know, but I mean, we're riding Big Thunder Mountain, so that's that. I mean, it's a win-win. Before I get on the ride, I really want to tell you the story about me going to the ER and finding out I have kidney stones because it was actually pretty funny. I woke up in the middle of the night and I had this horrible pain on my back, like my lower back left side. And it was really bad actually. So I didn't know what to do exactly and I was like, this is a new pain. I decided I'm just going to head on over to the emergency room. So I went there, they did a whole bunch of tests and then the doctor came in. The doctor walked in the room and he goes, well, you have kidney stones. And I was like, oh man, what do I do? And then he said, I need to watch my sodium intake. I need to stay away from red meat, drink plenty of fluids. And then he said, hey, do you have an annual pass to Disney World? And I was like, yes, yes I do. And then he said, if you have an annual pass, you should go to the Magic Kingdom and ride Big Thunder Mountain, doctor's orders. And I said, absolutely doctor, anything you say. So here I am doctor's orders I even kept my hospital bracelets on this whole entire time this one's for allergy I'm allergic to codeine look at Splash Mountain peeking up over there isn't that pretty wow I like that I bet you it's very nifty at night though oh yeah that's a good sunset picture right there yeah yeah I almost questioned why they picked Big Thunder Mountain to do the kidney stone test. And then I remembered it is the wildest ride in the wilderness. I also read the study actually and it said that your best bet is to always go to the farthest back to get the most push on those kidney stones.
Oh, I don't feel anything. Doctor's orders, though. <laughs> I don't know about kicking any kidney stones out, but that was a great ride. I absolutely love Big Thunder Mountain. I do have to use the restroom, so I mean, I don't know. Maybe something happened. I don't know. But uh, yeah, that's my first stop. It is such a hot day today. Look at the line for Splash Mountain. It's coming out all the way here. Holy moly. People just want to cool off. What's the wait time? Oh man, 165 minutes. Wow. I did have plans on actually riding this, but I'll come back another day. Oh, that's cool. They got a photo pass person right here for Splash Mountain. Catching those beautiful boat moments. Well, I don't think I passed that kidney stone. So I'm going to probably have to come back and ride Big Thunder Mountain again. It did say that in the study that they did, they rode it three consecutive times. Uh, I just didn't have time for that today. I mean, whew, it's pretty busy. Oh, look at this. I caught the show. I love it. Okay, all right. She's showing them how it's done. So I was on my way out of the park and look at this. I never see this central hub area this empty. Like, it is like midday. Look at all the people up there. There's nobody here. There's usually a line. Wow. The little things in life get me. They really do. <laughs> And with that, I think I am done here. Thanks so much for watching and coming and hanging out the Magic Kingdom with me as I attempt to pass a kidney stone. So live the life you live. I'll see you next time. Bye.